John, not a great first period, but I think you're sort of back in the mode where you're minimizing damage when you're not playing well. Maybe you've been there for a while. Do you know what I'm saying? Would you agree with that? Yeah, I don't think we were as bad as you probably think we were in the first, but uh, we weren't great. But um, that that's a hard-fought game against a desperate team and uh, a team with some big forwards. Yager, I mean, that's a good win for us. And uh, they're not always going to be like two or three goals are pretty. Uh, I, I like the way, especially how we handled the third period and the last shift, people blocking shots. Uh, yeah, so it's a, it's a good win at this time of year for us. One of the things that's really changed with you guys is the burst of offense you've gotten from the back end. And tonight, the, the goal from Wierenski seemed to lighten everybody up. And then yeah. Jack gets the primary assist. Can you just talk about the, the impact that your offense being engaged in creating is bad? Yeah, yeah, that's a, that's a big goal by Winnie. We, uh, again, we, we had some chances. We had some odd man rushes that uh, we just didn't get things done, accomplish anything offensively. Uh, you know, Jack... Jack, is, is, we didn't think Jack was going to play. He was so sick. So he fought through it. Uh, I thought really struggled for a number of minutes early on, but then found his game, uh, made some big plays, killing penalties. Uh, yeah, so our back end, you know, Jonesy goes a little unnoticed because that kid is grabbing all the headlines. And uh, uh, although I thought Jonesy fought it a little bit tonight with the puck, but I, I just like the way they stayed together uh, and just grinded away, made some mistakes, lost some coverages, uh, but still kept themselves involved and, and stayed with it, uh, both the back end and our forwards. So um, these are games that you learn from uh, where there's some struggle, there's momentum changes. Uh, I, th I thought we just stayed with it. I, I was ready to change the lines, uh, and then we end up score a couple goals, so we left it alone. Probably, a, uh, I probably would have made a mistake if I changed the lines in that game there. Uh, so, yeah, it's funny how things work out. Are you at a stage, Jim, where to expect a pretty win is, is unreasonable and you just kind of go with your patience and go with your ability to get... Yeah, you know, we've, we've got to manage the expectations as far as the minutes we play. The, the, uh, yeah, I, I think we have... Uh, I think, and i got to be careful how I say it, because I want our team to think it. We go out thinking we're going to win. And, and I think that's the bridge that we needed to cross this year and not hoping and let's see how it goes and let's see what the tempo of the game is. We go out and play. And I, I think we expect to win. Um, but when there's momentum swings in the game and it's not going your way, uh, and I'm the first one that has to watch myself uh, is, okay, let's just get through it. Let's not get into any type of panic or saying, what the hell's going on here? Uh, because we've had the lead a lot this year. Uh, so we've got to be able to handle these situations. I think at this time of year, where we're at, uh, hopefully and what we're going to go through here later on, uh, these games help us, will help us. And I, I think we have to manage the game and manage you guys too as far as expectations. John, even before Zach scored, it felt like the two penalty kills really also kind of gave the team a push. Did, did you see that? Great, great point, and, and that's the first thing I said in between the second and third period. Those were two great kills. Uh, we go down 2 nothing. I'm not sure where it goes. And a uh, huge part of the game. Our, our penalty killing is becoming more cohesive, I think. I think we've been more consistent. Uh, Bob has made some key saves at key times on that. Huge part of the game tonight. Coach, for you, and you've said many times, you're a teacher, and especially with kids so young. Are these the type of games that you're tested in that you really want for your team right now, kind of headed down the stretch? You know, you, you, you don't want to draw them up. Uh, you don't want to be down one nothing. Uh, uh, you don't want to play some of the minutes we played tonight. But when you go through that, you're going to have to go through it. It, it really gives you a good indication uh, an experience of, of going through that stuff. I, I, I think you can call this game a, a bit of an experience game for us, but that's a, that's a really desperate hockey team. They've got some big, strong, good forwards, and uh, the defense moves the puck well. They played a 7-2 game. They come in with confidence. That's a good experience game for us to, to work through and manage some of uh, – some indecisive play at times and, and really not some good play at times, but still find a way to win it. 
Do you want to draw it up that way? No, but you live through it, and I think that was very important tonight. It's the kind of game where you really see the value of a Matt Calvert who would seem to be everywhere and creating opportunities and checking and doing the stuff that he does. Yeah, you, you got you got Barkov, you got uh, Trocek, you, and you got that big uh, uh, Bukestad in the middle. Um, and, and I did. I, I, I The last four or five minutes, I didn't play Sam's line. Uh, they were an offensive threat all night long, but at that point in time, I wanted to protect that lead. It's hard for me to put Sam out against some of those guys there. And uh, Trocek's a smaller center, but you got some size there, and that's where Bill and, and that line came into play uh, and really created quite a bit of forechecking for us, too. Scores a big goal, and then they did a really good job checking in that last four or five minutes of the game. So, um, yeah, I have, I have thoughts about lines and, and all sorts of stuff, but uh, uh, I'm glad. I, I think I learned a little bit here, too, in, in just making sure not – I think you could set your team into a little bit of a panic if you start changing things around. I'm going to look at some different things along the way here. Tonight wasn't tonight, and I almost pulled the trigger, and I think I would hurt the club. Okay, thank you.